Lee Bellamy and David Strong. Your doctor is Dr. Patty Golden. Your timekeeper is Tiana Cavalli. Your referee in charge when that bell tolls, Mr. Mark Simpson. This fight brought to you by Scott Trilan from Sub Zero Recovery. Ladies and gentlemen, both warriors have now entered the ring. JWP3. We are sealing the ring as we speak. I cannot wait for this fight to start. I'm Brett Benetti, joined at ringside by Brett Dunn. Can't believe we're here. It's a privilege to call this main event. I'm still tingling. Seriously, we're John Wayne Parr, Australia's best ever, most living successful legend. living legend of a Thai boxer versus Daniel Dawson, obviously a former world champion Thai boxer in his own right, hometown hero and also professional boxer as well. Uh, it, it just makes up for a mouth-watering titles and three oh. disciplines. John Wayne Parr, legend of uh, Muay Thai kickboxing. Um, he's known worldwide. We've probably got a worldwide audience, so it's not just around Australia looking forward to this fight. We are joined by an audience audience worldwide and again we got the best seats in the house i hope you're enjoying it on go fight live but this is a fight that we've been looking forward to for a very long time of course daniel dawson spent a lot of time uh, you know fighting for world titles and uh, eliminators in boxing again uh, knocked austin uh, no doubt trout down three times in that fight uh, in the third round i believe as yep. well so yep. great performance and he's gone back to uh muay thai for this trilogy rematch and uh, we get to see it in Perth, WA. Cannot believe it. It's about to happen. Unbelievable. 16 years. 16 years since they last fought. Un unbelievable. Um, so in 1999, John Wayne Parr took a split point decision in a, in a Muay Thai bout. And then uh, in 2000, they met again as part of an eight-man eliminator, uh, for which Dawson managed to uh, knock Wayne Parr down uh, late in the fight. Uh, and, managed to get it and won the decision. Mm. And uh, apparently Wayne Parr 
guy's always been not too happy about that. He feels the uh, that that head kick that he copped was didn't really cause any damage and wasn't really worthy of an eight count. Thus, shouldn't cost him the fight. It's interesting. Uh, the fight uh, obviously a home down hero and Daniel the Rock Dawson, but John Wayne Parr, being the legend that he is, will have a lot of fans here. So I don't see any hometown advantage on tonight at all. It's incredible. But uh, again, Simo has the privilege of being the referee. Mark Simpson, again, he likes to be called Simo. Mr. Fig Jam himself has the honour of uh, refereeing this bout. Our judges at ringside, Billy Davis, Charlie Bellamy and David Tarong. So here we go, we're almost set. They did a uh, did a poll uh, in preparation for Origins on who would win. Uh, who came public, out on top? The public was very much divided. They did have 54 percent going the way of John Wayne Parr and 46 percent going the way of Daniel Dawson. John Wayne Parr's probably retired a couple of times, come out, but again he'll, he'll keep on fighting until he's 85, I think. The guy again fighting family. Angie Parr got kids who uh, loves the combat sport. He's slapping it up. He's got this superb crowd. Both fighters got a ton of support here. The only downside and I was uh, the performance of the National Anthem by the crowd. <laughs> Couldn't get in sync. It was no Jessica Malboy, no. No, no. Uh, John Demacall, he should have started off. I said, Australia's an industry. Shut up. And anyone would have joined in. Wayne Parr's usual Ram Moy finish there. Just turned and gave uh, a shot, a shot, a revolver at, uh, at Daniel Dawson there. His back was turned at the time. Uh, I'm pretty sure most of the uh, hitting that's going to go on, he'll be facing it. Here we go. He's, uh, he's waiting for uh, Simo to bring him in the middle for final instructions. Wow, we are here. Speaking of Denny, uh, Denny, the green machine, green as well. He's really looking forward to this one. That is some stare down. It's go time. No, no need for music in this one. The crowd is loud enough here. At the Herd Graham Recreation Centre, turn the music on. There's a healthy respect for each other between the two fighters, as all fighters have, but let's just say there's no love lost either. Both are really desperate to get this win. Dawson especially wants to rock the Muay Thai world with taking the scalp of, you know, Australia's best ever Thai boxer. Again, uh, respect uh, the referees wearing black armbands tonight. The King of Thailand passed away last night. We are alive. Here we go. And all. Dawson looks ready. John Wayne Parr looks ready. No need to tell. No need to say who's wearing who. They know who they are. This is happening. Here we go. Both fighters starting off with strong leg kicks. Yep. Right. Quick left to the body. Left to the body again with Parr. You're going to see that a lot tonight. Really favours that left switch kick, especially against the punches. And Daniel Dawson, with his eight years of a, a boxing career, is definitely what you would consider a puncher. Nice balance there. Nice catch by Dawson. Nice defence by Parr. Following up with punches off their leg kick, landing that thigh kick quite well at the moment. This is one, this main event scheduled for five three minute rounds. Mm. I think this is the range Wayne's gonna want to keep it at for a little bit. He's gonna be comfortable with the kicking range. Oh, left head kick there from, from Dawson. Nice by Dawson, nice comeback there by JWP. Nice again, mate. Again. 
part of his tactic will probably also be that Dawson's going to have really good footwork and movement and want to use angles. If he swells that thigh up nicely, Wayne Parr, well, then he's not going to be able to do that, nor is he going to be able to throw big punches off it. Nice big catch there by Dawson. Don't throw us over on the table. We want to see this fight continue. Nice body uh, punch there, shown by, thrown by JWP. Followed up with a leg kick. Dawson looking very comfortable with the Muay Thai at the moment. Nice front kick to the head there by Dawson. JWP returns to the body and nice little oh, yeah. flurry there. Wayne Parr, bread and butter there. Left rib kick and then that working the hands to that right thigh kick. All overhand right there as well. Both fighters having a ton of success early in this first round. The ground getting into it. Bruce to see how much Wayne Parr wants to trade hands. Especially with uh, Dawson's obvious boxing background. Nice by Dawson. Setting up those leg kicks again. Oh, nice touch there by Dawson. That box is going through. They exchange heavily. Nice left there by Dawson. We'll be on a bit of that exchange right in front of our commentary position, Brett. Yeah, Wayne Parr being very wary of that right hand of Dawson. Nice front kick again by Dawson, having a bit of success there in his first round. Wayne Parr going to the body. Still feeling. Oh, good solid leg kick there from Dawson. He can still throw them. But John Wayne Parr landed a good right hand in that exchange as we come to the end of round number one, final 10 seconds. Oh, nice punch oh, there to finish the round there by JWP. So nice punch punch is there by JWP. And he feels he finished that round strong. But I wouldn't say he won the round. It was very close. I'd hate to be a judge. That's a very, very close one to call that one. Wayne Parr is a very smart fighter. You'll notice as soon as he knew that last 10 seconds were on, he finished in a flurry. It's the way he always does. He likes to leave that impression. Anya. Ring girl. Here we go. I'm also wary of that that leg kick. Billy Davis, Charlie Bellamy, and uh, Darius Douch are judges for this main event. Dawson. Nice check there by Dawson. Two kicks check. Still hurt though. <laughs> well, he's managed to evade those uh, those thigh kicks early on, and checking as well. You might. Pushing forward there is JWP. And nothing landing. So good defence there shown by Dawson. Nice counter there by Dawson. there by JWP. Nice exchange there by both fighters. The Rock and the Gunslinger putting on a show for first. Oh, Wayne Parr goes down. And the world. World audience looking on. Perth, WA. Oh, good inside leg kick there. Wayne just checking that wasn't too low and just uh, just seeing if, if Daniel was all right. Good sportsmanship there. Tough boys. Daniel avoiding those hands of Wayne Parr fairly well. Got one for his troubles there. Wayne just missing with the overhand right. And Dawson just slipping, missing with that left hook. My fighters look tentative at the moment. Nice inside leg kick there by Dawson. Looking for the front kick as JWP comes forward. Right in front of our comedy position. Good punch there by JWP. Forward. Nice punch is there to the body by Dawson. Crowd acknowledges those. Oh, nice way returning with that left kick. That's why we're slim. Nothing there. No, nothing doing. Just living up to its to its hype at the moment, isn't it? Nice punch by Day WP. Here we go. Good in there. Play the right there. He's well in. it off. Nice leg kick there by JWP. John Wayne. Oh, good body shot. Success midway through the second round. Nice 
led to the reply by Dawson. Dawson still. Oh, 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 Dawson just coming back into his own now. Both fighters having their moment again in round two. Again, very close fight. Finishes it off strongly here. Oh, they know if we're ready to play that moment. Big stand out of the end two. Three of them, but they're nice hard shots. Dawson forcing JWP back. Good left kick again. Last That's 10 what seconds. Wayne Carr does to rack up the points. Continuing with that left kick, avoiding the oh. Nice finish there by Dawson as they go swinging at each other to finish off round three. Wow. <laughs> You know, 40 years we could have, um, you know, Wayne Park bought out Cage Muay Thai, maybe we'll have Nursing Home Muay Thai. Yeah. Both fighters have not taken their eyes off each other in yeah. the corners, and both fighters taken the corners uh, the stools as well. So each of them are eager to show the other that they're not hurt and they're not panicking. Both look in great condition. Top Sangrat. He's right there in 
Daniel's corner, he's saying to use more elbows. It'll be interesting to see whether Daniel, because he hasn't really opened up with any elbows yet. It'll be interesting to see whether this is the round where he lets go. Round four. See who the pressure fighter is. Both, both, are in, fresh. both of them incredibly well wing, uh, ring conditioned. Oh! Thought it was MMA for a second, he was better. Toss him over like the Royal Rumble. Almost going for the suplex there. And the ball would have been out one on our table as well, which would not have been good. <laughs> oh, it's oh, the right part of the kick this time. Fantasy to get round. He got round the back of his head without hitting him in there, so they're legal strikes. moments there for JWP. Logan dropped by the Dawson though. Very good defense. Still looks fresh. Now it's Dawson soon. Let's see what he comes up with. Now it's shot to the body by Dawson. The Rock is coming back. Now it's over right in front of our commentary position. Nice right punch there by D JWP. Certainly favouring that overhand at the moment off the skip, so he's not telegraphing it. Oh, oh big body shot. Good, good, good moments there by jo for John Wayne Parr. Oh, big oh, overhand man. right by John Wayne Parr. Oh, Wayne Parr's starting to look a little bit more comfortable now. He is. See what uh, The Rock can do to get back into this fourth round. Doubling up. They reset and they go at it again. Big up and right from Dawson. One back from, from Wayne Park. None of them really connecting. Oh, oh, nice, oh. nice left hook there by Dawson. Right on the kisser. Bit of a smile after that too to say, I got you one, mate. This is an opportunity. John Wayne Parr keeping him off with that left kick. Wayne Parr looking a little bit rattled. Here he comes back. Dawson's corner. Imploring to get on him. Saying this is the opportunity. Oh, avoiding that hook with that left kick. That's a Wayne Parr specialty. Avoiding that punch, delivering that rib kick right to the, to the ribs. With his left, did that on Zambides all day when they last fought. Nice drop there by Dawson as John Wayne Park comes forward. Another nice oh, leg kick. They start taking their toll. Another nice leg kick there by Dawson. Coming to the end of round number four. Nice moment, nice end of the round by Dawson. John Wayne Park fights back. This is incredible. Australia, all around the world. Everyone's tuning in to Go Fight Live to watch this. This is an incredible fight, years in the making, and they are putting on a show for the fans. And we get to step inside for it. Incredible. And this is not just another fight for them. This is this is a pride, this is a legacy type issue. All rounds of action comes out round five. This round is gonna be incredible. Look for the firework here. Yep. And rightfully or wrongfully, when people look back and go, who was the best Australian Thai boxer? I mean, no, Wayne Parr was as the greatest record. At the same time, people are going to remember if Daniel Dawson beat him twice or if he beat Daniel Dawson twice. Taking their eyes off each other. They're going to touch gloves, but they're going to go at it right away. Let's see who can get on advantage first. There's people here on their feet. They have not been able to sit down here at the first Graham Recreation Centre. Here we go. Let's see who can get on top. Who wants it more? Fast starting early. This is going to be a very, very fast-paced round. We're not going to stop for the full three minutes of this one. So my park in off early. 
From my park, oh, you like park. Let's see Dawson, the rock, get fight back. He does. Pushes forward now. Tulane Park happy to set off off that fly kick. Every fly kick doesn't hit. He'll fire with his hands and his elbow off it because he knows Daniel Dawson's thinking about it. JWP looking good early in this fifth and final round. Dawson needs to find a way inside. Oh, nice punch there by JWP. Dawson needs to put his foot on the gas now. Yep, now's the time. JWP's had his moments, but now it's right. time for the Rock to fight back. That's right. Whitebar's had his minute, minute of a flurry. Dawson needs to come back, starting off with that big hook. Dawson's gone and pour him. Pour it on right now. Now's your time. The gunslinger pushing forward. Two legends in the ring now. What a fight. Good left kick across the midsection there from Dawson. Right palm. Another nice Still sleepy. working that guy. Wow. Nice oh. oh. by there by Dawson. He's fighting back and now. JWP said. It's back and forward. They are leaving nothing and there's no playing it safe because there's no sure winner at the moment. Jeez, can we have a round six? Wayne Palmer is spinning back. Oh, oh, no, Drops a awesome. big right hand for his troubles. Left hand from Wayne Palmer back at him. Nice exchange there by Wayne Palmer. They have not been ye stopped yelling for the first round. They've been making noise all night. Nice by both exchanges there. Oh, nice oh, punch there by Lawson. What a chin JWP has. Both guys so durable. Wayne Parr looks fresher in this round than he did in the third. Uh, the guy just uh, doesn't stop. Energizer bunny. They both have a smile at each other. They both oh, respect each other. Big body shot. Oh, he got it right. Dawson really trying to push forward and make something happen. Wayne happy to dance around the outside, hit him with those kicks. We end up closing wages at round number five of the main event. The fight we've been looking forward to for so long. Nice left up there by Dawson. Last 10 seconds. Let's see the go. Weeks now. Here we go. Check for Wayne Park, Flurry to finish. Wow. Oh, I want to see a fourth fight. Make it a quadrilogy. And shame on anyone who doubts a 40-year-old or a 38-year-old can't put on a hell of a fight. These boys show age is just the number. When they say it, these guys set the example for that term. Age is just a number. Two bottles of prime wine just there. I, I have to say, I gave a slight edge to John Wayne Parr in the fight. I think he's going to get uh, a unanimous points decision. Don't be surprised if it's a split decision, but I think that John Wayne Parr took it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say two rounds to three as well. Uh, I, I think Wayne Parr will end up on top for this one. He definitely, definitely decided in that last round that he was taking that round. But geez, both, Daniel, both corners are very confident and there's no controversy in the way. They give the fight to Dawson. No, no controversy. Close fight. But I do believe that JWP, J, JWP the gunslinger, has got it. Good show of respect between both the fighters. Oh, well, has to be. I mean, they just they put on the show. I mean, this fight might be for them, uh, legacy-wise, and to settle the score, but really it's for the fans. And haven't the fans benefited from what's happened to There's a packed house here at the Herb Grain Recreation Centre in WA. They have seen a show. The full card has been fantastic, but the main event has stolen the show. That's what we expect. We're waiting for the judges' scorecards. John Z. McCauley is uh, waiting for them. I can't wait for them to be read out. Both fighters are ready. Both fighters in opposite corners showing their appreciation and congratulations. Both all rounds had back and forth action. It might have just came down to that fifth, and I think that JWP took the fifth. I think you said it right, Brent. Sometimes these main events don't live up to the hype. 
this one went beyond. Yep. I, I want to see it again. And they boy, these boys want to do it again. At least I hope they do. It's been incredible. Again, Brett Benetti joining you ringside. Fred Dunn. We've seen a fantastic evening. We're going to send it up right now to John Jim McCauley. And we're going to hear the decision. Who has won this fight? Ladies and gentlemen, before we go to the judges' scorecards, please, the stand and ovation for these two warriors. Judge the score at 50 45, that was way off. I think I, 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 I don't mind the 40s, 40, 47 49 or 50 48. 50 48, I probably like the most. 50 45, that means they didn't give a round to uh, Danny Dawson, that's all right. No, yeah, no, I, I think Dawson took, I think Dawson took one to two rounds. Um, Wayne Parr's uncanny at being able to rack up points with his continuous work rate. Daniel 
Daniel Dawson, a guy who's just come to the boxing world. He knows it'll be a hard fight. At your young age and with the life you've had and the fights you've done, what keeps you going in the week in, week out to fight and fight and just keep fighting against the best in the world, either being Muay Thai in a cage or Muay Thai in the ring? You're not allowed to ever say no and you always rise to every challenge. How do you do it? John, you're an absolute legend. I'm sure I'm going to thank you for it.